uh, DK, as in boneless swings are better than traditional. Yeah. So, uh, so, so a Bowser DK is a Bowser. worse DK. To be fair, they have key differences that make them different as characters. Look at this tech skill from Up Chuckle. Yo, sick up tilts. Gonna see. So I've actually fought these two like <laughs> way too much. I've fought up chuckle. I've right now I'm 0-2 against uh, Fahrenheit in the Fahrenheit sets, but I've only played up chuckle once in bracket, which was yesterday. And, uh, it was 2-1. Green is pretty good. He has a bad habit of jumping off the ledge. Oh, oh, oh! You know this? That, that was the actual first match. There. Uh, All right. So yeah, up chuckle. <laughs> Convincingly taking that in Fahrenheit's head so deep that he forced him to SD. <laughs> he is bending him to his will. <clears throat> oh, that wasn't for real, apparently. Dang, I wouldn't have known. Oh, what? That was but a they're running... check? I couldn't. Oof. I thought that up tilt was just a mind game. But game one, we've got Bowser against Greninja. Um, Greninja... Sort of has an issue with uh, grapplers. Grappler characters can really give this character a hard time. Why do you think that is? Um, well, for one, uh, a lot of Greninja's, like his, um, <laughs> let's talk about Greninja's combo game first. So Up Chuckle is showing off some pretty cool little fancy uh, techniques right there with the uh, that's near not foot his, stools. Like, that's not his coolest stuff. Yeah, that's too. that's not even his final form. Okay, so like you know, commentator bets. I'm totally gonna be biased towards. Uh, I want up chuckle Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit. Yeah, okay. Fahrenheit. I feel like um, <laughs> Fahrenheit's going to win, but I feel like I want up chuckle. I like Greninja. I guess a character. He's one of my favorites. Oh, that's it. Ooh, that was a great edge guard. But one reason, uh, if uh, that. Oh, here we go. As I talk about it, um, Bowser and DK mainly, uh, their grappler as grapplers, their punish game on Greninja is huge. Because if you look at uh, Greninja's uh, stats, mid weight, extremely fast faller, like extremely yeah. fast, he's like top five fastest fallers in this game. Um, so he's, go I believe he's number fourth fastest, or no, not four. I think he's four actually, yeah. But he falls extremely fast, so that's going to make him combo food. And like that, boom, one grab, 87, dead. Bowser's range uh, for the Koopa is going to be massive because uh, of his fall speed yeah. and the general nature of his confirm. Yeah, I notice. Uh, <laughs> but what Greninja has a, is a doing? Tendency to just, like he gets beat up and then he grabs you and then you die. That's yeah. That's that's not even just a Fahrenheit. Thing, that's Bowser. He eats a lot of damage. He has a terrible disadvantage state, but his advantage state is almost as, I'd say it's nearly as good as how bad his advantage state is. Good air dodge even. Jab, jab into the down air. So I'll tell you why I think the, the, the matchup uh, for Turninja is not as good for um, Bowser as it would be for like, you know, most heavyweights. I think it's because a lot of Greninja's stuff comes off of Nair. And if you miss space Nair on shield, what happens? You, you get, get grabbed. What? Okay. He SD. He, uh, up chuckle once again, putting the fear in his heart. Just like the button check. <laughs> Unfortunate SD, though, for uh, S come Fahrenheit. But yeah, so, um, <laughs> the Nair, if you, if you miss space it, it's unsafe on shield. You get grabbed, you're dead. Yeah, and then if percent. you go for forward air, it's laggy. So like, if you whiffs it, you get grabbed, you die. So yeah, it's, you get pivot grab. He has by to Bowser. make a commitment to how he's gonna approach. Exactly like that. Yeah. Up B out of shield, great at dealing with anything that uh, lands on shield. Up B back air, up B 41%. Nair catching the jump. Up trouble loves jumping off the ledge. He's going to like, jump off the ledge. I think. <laughs> I think like you'll see like maybe one you or know two what times. Would be a really like swaggy thing that I want to see. Down. Did you just see that? He just landed with the side B and he went past the shuriken and then no he went past the shuriken shuriken went straight through his hitbox uh, or through his hurt box that was crazy so Z -axis, uh, please yeah, yeah. please I hate Z axis at least it's not Lilac but he's dead well, uh, not gonna miss that confirm more, he's been playing Bowser for a while I'm I guessing th and uh, that confirms really easy so yeah I think seeing what's him miss gonna it would be, be like really strong for this matchup is that. Um, Notice how he's always landing with like an aerial or unsafe. Yeah. And then no or, uh, Fahrenheit grabs. Yeah. And then that's like GG. You know. Yeah. GG easy. But
but if Greninja can continually put uh, Bowser in this corner in disadvantage, look at that, landing with Nair, unsafe. Not even, not doing anything after that, uh, what's it called, after that Nair, just let him still get hit. Oh, that was a really good Shadow Spear. Ooh, delaying the up B so he doesn't get hit, like uh, last game. Ooh, pivot grab. Uh. <laughs> Rapid jabs. Yep, just hold shield and forward tilt it. Completely safe. Uh. Keeps jumping off the ledge. He's going to keep getting hit. Right now, uh, Greninja not in the percentage to get hit just because of the rage that Bowser has. <laughs> nice yeah, but wave if he gets hit with like a stray hit, it's done. Yeah, like a forward tilt, yeah, up air, boom. Yep. Overzealous at the ledge, you gotta really be careful against Bowser. You just gotta watch what he's doing. Yeah, and it comes out to a lot of commitments, you know? Yeah. Um, Bowser is one of those characters that you wanna play very safe against because uh, once he gets in, then you know, you, you're forced to just watch your, yourself get like, hit by all this guy. Oh, yeah, here we go, the Charizard. Okay. I actually fought this Zard, so. This Zard is clean. I, I beat yeah. it, but it's pretty good. Yeah. It's because I don't play a, I didn't play a grappler against it, so I don't know why. This is his grappler counter pick. Charizard, you'd think, because he's super heavy, he would be a hard character to like, or he'd be an easy character to combo, right? Mm -hmm. No, his uh, percentages against the grapplers are actually slimmer compared to most. Yeah, because of his weight, mm -hmm. he's uh, actually really hard to kill off the top. But his ball speed is actually floaty, so mm -hmm. he's not going to be getting hit at a large percent those range. Those big wings, dude. Those wings, man. He's Red Bull. Um, Shout out to Red Bull. <laughs> Great thing about Charizard too is that his, his flight throw is like a lot better than others. Yeah. Just because it, it has the like range actual and it's, stopping. Yeah, powers. it's it has a lot of range and it's focused. Yeah. Um, I think for for this <laughs> matchup, he's gonna be mixing up his landings with the jumps and, and not getting hit as bad. But since he's also a thick boy, uh, he's gonna be taking some yeah. big punishes when he doesn't do it. Like doesn't land right. Yeah. Uh, but right now, uh, I honestly believe Charizard is beats uh. Bowser. Mm, I wouldn't go as far to say that. I would say it's probably even. I'd say it's even at best for Bowser. I think if anything it's even in. at best for Charizard. I don't or think so. Ooh. Like, very that was a very good confirm. That's actually a hard like window to get on Charizard. Like he made it look God easy. Like, like yeah. he, just, he just has it. That window, I mean for Bowser it's not as hard, but for DK, because I use DK more than either one of them. Uh -huh. Ooh. Another thing, um, the edge guarding. So I think Charizard. He's too much. Yeah, he's playing way too many footsies against Bowser. You, you don't play footsies against Bowser's Charizard. Yeah, because like you play a his best option is grab, right? And he hasn't grabbed once. Have you seen him get a grab? Who Charizard? Yeah. No, he doesn't. Like he, he boxes doesn't. with jab and then grabs. Yeah, but I haven't seen. Him. Ooh, I've good seen two jab, frame. But like not anything else. The thing about a Charizard is uh, his ledge animation is really bad. So, do uh, you see how high he's hanging? Yeah. And then that's please, how he got please stop jumping point. off the ledge. Jesus Christ. Please. He has, he's only jumped off the ledge. He's making me mad. I don't want to it's see It's the this. no mix-up mix-up. It's, it's the no mix-up, not a mix-up, because he's getting caught every time for it. And he's just jumping. He just loves that Y button too much. Honestly, if he could just mix up how he's getting off the ledge more, like even just drop off aerially. I know it's heavy. Or since Sucks he's using off the ledge. Um, flamethrower, if he just like side plays on the stage and calls him out on it, he can get like a. He get nice a pretty juicy 19%. Yeah. Honestly though, um, doing down B would be more safe and uh, give him oh, more yeah. reward. Yeah. Jumping off with down B, armor, a lot of armor, uh, does over 30%. I did think it does like 30% uh, if you get every hit. That you can't end, edge cancel side. B. That'd, that'd be, be so busted. Good. Yeah, that'd be so good. You just like side. B. But a lot of things that uh, okay. this Charizard's not doing, he needs, yeah, there you go. It's like seeing the jabs. Now he's juggling it. Look at this. Up smash, intangible wings. Bowser cannot land against oh, that. Oh, it's intangible? Yeah, his wings are intangible. Every super heavy besides uh, Ganondorf has intangibility on their uh, smashes and tilts. So, like, jabs, his uh, claws are intangible, I believe. Uh, forward tilt. I, I don't think uh, Charizard's forward tilt is, but Bowser. Okay. Right there, these these are the very important um, like um, Look at this. confrontations. Is that what they call? Yeah. Uh, Exchanges. Yeah. So he's giving up stage control to Bowser, which is something you don't want to do. You can wall him out with your jab and stuff like that. Yeah. I think 
giving up the stage control is fine if you can put him in the air. As Charizard, if you're putting him in the air, you're at such a huge advantage because yeah, his up tilt, up airs, no, he's good. Oh. See, look at that. Do you see that? 88 and it didn't connect because it's not true at that point. Oh my Ooh. god. Good reaction. Side B on to oh. oh, dude, really? <laughs> we just hold forward smash and wait for the roll in because we have that many balls and jumping off the ledge. Please stop. Look at that. See, landed with the. I was going Send to this earlier. Up, Send help. Please hey, disable his wipe button. Good DI. Look at this. Charizard's so hard to kill. Good. Oh, that was a good way to get. There he goes. There. A mix up. Thank God. <laughs> he mixed up his ledge option. What a god. Also, his Nair, uh, actually really good at landing. If you uh, fade back with it, you can actually like make it completely safe. Nope, he's not going to get hit through the platform by that down there. And his up smash is just going to cover everything. Charizard's juggling is actually really good. He's, he yeah, can stay no, on the ground I, I with low commitment. It, uh, experienced it for myself. Eventually. Yeah, I, I experienced it also, but I played Metal so I didn't really have any issues. Uh, yeah. <laughs> just press Y, like, I have five jumps. Uh, I and I have vanish. Yeah. Just, uh, get hit with uh, tangible up smash. Ooh, I'm yeah, look at this. Here, I'm like, what? This is Yeah, there we Ooh, that was a great back here. Showing how I believe good. he played the matchup at that time. Yeah. He was able to put him in the oh air, God. juggle him with these uh, up smashes. He could use more up tilts also mm -hmm. if he didn't want to stale the up smash. They both uh, have the same effect. Put him in the air, uh, can't be challenged. Um, Bowser has no good landing option. He has random burst options and it's like, please be bad and uh, get hit by this down air or this down B. It's basically Hail Marys. He can only throw Hail Marys. But 2-2, two, two, this is a good set. Um, I like the adaptations. Uh, that's last game with Charizard. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, a lot better. I mean, the jumping was still there. Yeah, the jumping was still there, but he threw one mix-up in. Yeah. And yeah. I'm proud of him. I did. The, the flame throw to start off things. Yeah, really putting good. himself in the corner, I don't like that. But I like that landing with Nair into jabs. Yeah. It's safe. Uh, Bowser can't grab that. At this point, they're both scared. I think uh, Charizard's feeling a lot more confident, actually. I don't think he's as scared. I think he's he's feeling himself. Look at this. Yeah. He's calling out the jumps. Oh, okay, yeah. He I called, that, the, he called the out the landing. Smash. He just didn't... Uh, he called out that landing, but he didn't space himself properly. You're right. Yeah, yeah. I can see it. He's, he's really feeling himself. Look at this. Ooh. Okay. He could have shielded that, but... Um, he didn't because he was didn't. confident and he wanted to run He wanted to keep that. pressing moves. Yeah. Now he's getting uh, hit for it. Yeah, um, I think if he loses good his, his stock first, he's gonna play like more the reserved. First game. Yeah, he's gonna play more reserved, and we don't. Want, I don't think he needs to be played reserved. I think he needs to be aggressive. I think yeah. he needs to punish Bowser. There. Look okay, at that. There's the grab. I, um, if you if you went for that side B, you would have been mad. Yeah. Good roll. Like, good uh, roll stuff. reaction. I would say read, but he like saw him move. Bowser's bad. So Ooh. back air, almost taking it heavy. Bowser's so heavy. <laughs> he said, nah, you're not coming Bowser back, sir. Bowser can also uh, cancel his momentum with his jump and then live like a couple percent. Yeah. I think that's it. Nah, it's, about, it's Charizard, I told you. Huh. The heavy floaty. You're right, you're right. It's like uh, Samus in PM. Yeah, or Samus in this game. Um, yeah? <laughs> it's heavy, really heavy and really floaty. Huh. She's always been a super floaty character, I believe, since Melee. And uh, 64. Ooh, that was Ooh. a good uh, landing with that down B. Super armor for so many frames, starting at frame four. Uh, that Nair. I think this is it. Yeah. He's going to get the, the read and it's going to be over. No? Okay. Oh, no. All right. Okay. Even game. Can't count him out. Yeah. yeah, definitely. With only 66 I was honestly thinking uh, the Charizard would up be. Yeah. Nope. He could have punished that a lot Ooh. harder. Oh, that that's, that's not what you want to see. Would you call this an upset? Um, I mean, number one PR over state, number two PR over state. It's an upset in rank, but it's an upset in rank. You don't really see Upchuckle take many sets off of uh, Noah, but it's not completely out of its realm. It's not unexpected. You could, yeah. you can definitely see this happening. Yeah. It's Charizard, a very strong secondary. The, the, the Charizard definitely paid off. Like, I, I really like, like that, that switch. Was, that was actually uh, really good. I, I, the first game with the Charizard, I thought he was just going to get scummed on and it was going to be like, you know, GG easy, pack up your controller, leave. I saw him making the adaptations in second game as the game went on. Yeah, yeah. So Especially I figured he would bring it. Like Definitely. You were saying